checking out our first alert weather forecast this morning. I know Mary, we were talking in a story earlier about uh, skin cancer awareness month and sunscreen, and we're actually going to be seeing a lot of sunshine this week. And you said the sun rays can be stronger. Oh this yeah, time of year. So sunscreen. use that sunscreen. I've learned with age, sunscreen is my friend. I even wear it every day, and I mean mm -hmm. we're gonna have so much sunshine. Everyone's gonna be outside this week mm -hmm. because we're seeing a big, big warm up, 70s and even 80s. So very summer like. Even the little ones, don't forget to put sunscreen on them. So right now it looks absolutely beautiful outside. But look how much water is in the North Shore right now. So that is why there's that flood advisory in place. 10th Street bypass is closed, but yeah, do not try to walk along the North Shore River Walk because it is flooded. 42 degrees right now. It is a little bit cooler than average. Winds out of the east northeast about 5 to 10 miles per hour. So currently sunshine around the map, but we have some cold spots. 35 in Butler, 36 in Franklin, 37 Washington and 39 in Latrobe. If you're heading out for Mother's Day brunch, 10 o'clock temperatures will be in the 50s. The power of the sun, it is strong this time of the year, so that's going to help to warm us back up to the 60s this afternoon. High pressure situated. That's going to keep us nice and quiet and dry for the next several days and we're over the rain and it's going to stay away at least until next weekend. But here's that flood advisory that I was talking about. That's actually going to go all the way through Monday night. The good news, it is receding, but it is just over 21 and a half feet right now. So that's when they closed the 10th Street bypass as a precaution, but water all over the North Shore. If you're going to be mowing today, I'm not talking about the moms. I'm talking about the dads. Are you going to be mowing the lawn today? Maybe doing some yard work while mom takes a nap. If you're going to, it looks fantastic to do so. Looking at Futurecast, it is quiet. I mean, we have a few clouds that are going to be rolling in overnight and just a few clouds here or there, even tomorrow morning. The only thing is just going to be a chilly start at the bus stop tomorrow, very similar to where we are right now, but sunshine will warm things up. So grab the jacket tomorrow morning, but then you'll be shedding those layers later on. Looking at our seven day forecast, 70s. It's perfect tomorrow. Mid 70s Tuesday. This is my favorite weather. Mid to upper 40s for the lows. So we're right around average tomorrow. Some areas tomorrow morning with those clear skies may drop to the lower 40s because we don't have those clouds acting like a blanket keeping us warmer. But all through the week, this is very rare. High temperatures near 80, probably been touching the 80s for a lot of areas on Wednesday because of all that sunshine. By Thursday, 82 degrees, looks beautiful. 83 Friday, then the chance for showers and storms move back in on Saturday.